am I? Who are you? Shatter that. Never submit. To preserve beauty and protect all life. Hello everyone, just want to let you know that you can get 10% off for any subscription at MasteringRuneTerra.com using my code LuckyCat. They have strategy articles, regular tournament, weekly 3 hours learning call, and many more. For the details, check out the link in the description below. Now back to the gameplay. Um... Ebers, uh, Gwen, and any deck should be not so hard, right? Let's see. You can kill my Starhorn pack easily, too. That is a problem. You shouldn't run that much card in this deck. Uh, it's I mean unit. Uh, it should be heavy on spell. Interesting. Maybe Pell Cascade is okay. We have alternate win con with winning like two. Unseen, unheard. <laughs> what? I'm impressed that he get elusive unit. Flowers upon my blade. The brighter my light, the stronger your shadow. Rough and his flock already, huh? Oh, it's Raffinus Flop for sure. Let's go hard. Um, I will start playing my Starhorn Pack. Starhorn Pack will become our alternate win con. But he already played double go hard. So I'm going to lost by Raffinus Flock, right? Because it will cancel my Sadie character. Hmm. I shouldn't throw away my Guiding Touch. Ah, now this Sadie character is just weak. Oh, 
I will let the Gwen pass because of this integrate. Another scorcher, huh? A uh, steady character again uh, can be a risky play. We have a nice board for winding light. It can cost a little too. And I'm pretty safe from withering well. Uh, by doing that way, we are preventing our stun hope star hunt pack from um, Scorcher or Ravenous Flop. That way, we can block Gwen safely. Transform me into an exact copy, which means I'm ready to shine. Unethical. No! They forced us to choose death or the blade. I shall need my tools. How can he become so lucky to get that card? I can stop any at a time, but I have to play this too. What do you mean I'm not on the list? Can we win this game? Um, the go hard really ruin us. Yes. No more hiding. No more go hard for you, and he is about to running out of card too. Scissors at the ready. This into grad or what? That is so lame. Why? Oh, uh, he he is playing around. Uh, here I uh he is playing, uh, not any disintegrate, but I'm not going to give him T burst too. So go away, no T burst for you. T burst can wipe out our board. This can be used for winding like or Aphelios. Um Temperament 
little less moonlight. Uh, let's go wide with Crescendum next turn. And then we are going to give our Star Hunt Peg the Infernum for sure. Oh <laughs> no Infernum. Uh, Sephirum is okay. Oh he's drawing more cards. Double Ravenous Flock. <laughs> that is crazy if he do that. Ooh, elusive. Ooh, more elusive. <laughs> nice game. Rest now, fell. Feel the moonlight's uh, the only way to win against Kaisa is hopefully he have a bad hand. <laughs> Because Kaisa with Scout is nightmare. Don't think we can win this game easily unless we can try to find a combo cloaker, a lot of it. What is his like, turn to play? Uh, Patricide Broadwing probably. Can we play Lunarita Speed out too? Only a fool would enter battle unprepared. Let's go aggressive here. But it's just a Void Link. Anything else? I don't mind threat with Void Link because Void Link can grow into 3-3. Three, three. And it's not so hard for this deck to grow if off you need to 3 3, right? Next, we are going to get Aphelios. Calibrum to kill. Is gonna make a meal of them. Sure. We'll get our licks in. Um. Take it. There's nothing much we can do. He already targeting my Aphelios. I don't really want to lose Star Hunt Pack easily too. Um, I'm in Tariq. Oh, he's drawing a lot of cards. Yeah, uh, my power is so not so big. Uh, the good thing here is we can treasure fate twice, and both of our fate. Uh, I mean, if we have double star hunt in our board, we can treasure powering up star hunt pack by twice. But uh, this CD character uh, will lose his fate, but it has more power. I wonder how. It already triggering Star Hunt back twice. Interesting. 
I still have Calibro, maybe we can target better unit like Valor. And the only way to win against this deck is hopefully the opponent hand is like getting brick. No Kaisa yet. If only I have Kamo Cloaker too, that could be very good for us. Because I'm going to draw more. Um, it is a ris risky play, he should just play it into this barrier unit. Isa is too powerful. Oh, it's Camo Cloaker, but I don't have enough mana for Tariq yet. One mana off for Tariq. He's burning more mana than us. No Kaisa, huh? We got a lot of Camo Cloaker. Who am I? Who are you? I can almost taste it by the void. Kaisa is not F of it. Oh, it's F of. The every um, just makes me stronger. The problem here is if he has Fowler, then he can wipe out our. Board. I'll show you how to fight. But if not, then we are still Take able two. to kill Kaisa, right? <laughs> um, looks like we are going to have lethal if we just open attack with Camo Cloaker. <laughs> yeah, we win against Kai Sadek for sure. Now the concert of strike cannot stop me too. Um, Sarpside can save him for sure, but he lost his Kaisa. Uh, never mind, he can block with this one too. Alright. <laughs> we missed our little. Uh, actually, we can Mystic Shot him. There's no heal in his deck, right? Ooh, we win against Meta deck. I like that. How about this? You want to see my Starhorn pack? A oh, right of negation maybe. Please no right of negation. <laughs> GG! <laughs> Pretty strong deck, huh?
Too much guiding touch. Um, boisterous wholesome. Um, we can throw away gem in the future. We are going to get gem unless this mountain god die by Alphys, but he's not going to do that, right? Or blocking the quick attack Join the hunters, they said. Yeah, he's not going to do, I believe. Um, here uh, we... Please, make yourself right at home. Um, never mind, I'm not going to throw away. I need to block, right? Anything else? <laughs> Mystic shot is okay. So I will just play iterative improvement into my star horn pick. I'm not going to give him hallowed yet because hallowed can very disgusting with overwhelm. But he deals some cheap damage into my nexus too. Not a fan for it. If it pass then we are just going to pass back. Uh, never mind, I can steal Triggering Fate. Will we kill his unit one by one with our big Star Hunt pack? I think we can do that. He said I'm going to. Oops. You can pass if you want. Let's just wait until we get some camo cloaker and then copying the elusive star home pack with my um steady character. Oh what he is trying to do? Hmm? Hmm? He's not having a tech token. Um uh, what is that? What is that? What is that? Oh oh oh, oh. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> I thought he want to play the Gwen spell. The Atrocity only for unit card. It could be very disgusting too because I not have enough mana for um, Mystic Shots. Daddy character is okay. Ooh, Alphelios. Alphelios can give us lifesteal. But for now, maybe we are just going to... What should we do? Alphelios first, probably. Yeah, play more reforts, please. Only one. Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes. On to the next. As darkness falls, the moon rises.
Um, just to prevent my Starhorn pack die by the file fish. What? He is not developing in this kind of aggro deck? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Just to treat your fate like that, not going to happen. I will gladly burn his mana. Crack up the pen, huh? I'm creating another moon weapon, right? Because I'm throwing away one of it. Yeah, since he is running Ravgonus Flock, I think it is just too risky if we play Sadie character into this Starhorn pack. But last time he only played one star. Uh, one. Oh, wait a minute. He's doing it wrong? You can have. He should play Overwhelm into this one. I'm not understand. Now he just get a very weak swing. Should we bait for Ravenous Flock? Because I have Pale Cascad here. He only have. He already play one Ravenous Flock, so there is two more. Oh, it's bloody business. <laughs> nope. Thank you. Yeah, go surrender now. Yeah, you can roughness block me. I don't care. I have Pell Cascade. <laughs> After this, is not leveling up yet. Ew! Look at this, my Starhorn pack. I have two of it. Ew! Don't have a way to. I lost against Ruination, if he has it, but if not then we are just overkill him. Yeah, this is such a greedy play, please don't follow it. I'm not going to aim at first because there's a chance of Ruination. <laughs> no Ruination. Alright GG, nice game. <laughs> Keep faith, Aphelios, and we will find... Um, who play against any Twisted Fed? Such a strong deck if he managed to reach turn 8. We got our Aphelios, but he got his T-Bark too. Which is problematic. Uh, we can stop any. I don't like that one too. So let's pass for now. I wonder where is my Starhorn. No Starhorn yet. Remember our promise, Aphelios. Nice, he is not developing. Um, still no Starhorn, unfortunately. We can disintegrate our Tariq so easy. He's burning more mana than us, so I think we should be fine. Okay, it is disintegrate. So no Moon Weapon for us, maybe. Beauty and life. How about Raffinus Flop? Dazzling, 
unyielding. He take all the damage. So I assume that he doesn't has the roughness flock yet. Um, I don't really like it from beyond. Maybe I should swap it away. What should I do? It's not running any so far, so I think we can remove this first. Yeah, I think I can uh, chance this gift from beyond. To protect, never submit. Starting to draw more card. Um, make it rain doesn't do anything to us. I still able to hush this, right? Red card doesn't kill me. Let's hush. Dead in their tracks. Crash and them first, maybe. Or Calibrum or Graphitum. Yeah, I think Graphitum is relevant. Because I can stun T Bob. I almost leveling up Tarik too. He's trying to roughness lock me, maybe. But I still have guiding touch. Hmm. There is nowhere left to go but up. Um let's give immortality to my Tarik first. Can we develop more? My Tarik is immortal, so let's powering up Tarik and have a little next turn. Yeah, I don't really like this game from beyond since I can't get Infernum. Sharp, unyielding. <laughs> this is where is the unyielding? What? I don't get the immortality. What, what, what? My supporter LA and I cannot take damage. Hmm. So I don't take any damage, right? <laughs> GG. Yeah, it's a visual bug. I still give um, any spell to Tarik to copy it first. It's better. Soraka and Sifana. We got a Star Horn pack. Only a fool would enter uh, we play Lunari Dustbringer first. If we doesn't, no if we don't find the Nightfall unit like Aphelios, maybe we are just going to discard it with John Urchin. But if we found Aphelios, then we play Dust Petal Dust. Stuff and camo cloaker, maybe good with star hunt pack. Looks like we can go aggressive here.
What is his turn 3 play? Is that only Soraka? I think it is Soraka, it's so I'm going to deal 4 damage here. Because I don't want to get blocked by Soraka too. Or this wounded white flame. The dragon's rage claws to get out. Beauty and life. They are nothing. Not going to block you. How about single combat? Dealing 6 damage here. Get some draw too, and we can have some finisher with Winding Light. So, this deck basically. The playstyle is like. Victor Aphelios. Oh, it has a challenger. Can we remove this? I think I will kill this one with my sunburst. I only have one sunburst. Oh, I can copy Arhon Peg. So we are going to lost Tariq. Uh, next turn I will going to try finish him with Winding Light. Oops, he doesn't kill my Tariq. No, I haven't seen those Yoda tricks yet. <laughs> um, my board is just too full right now. Can he kill something? But I don't want to lose my Tariq too. Hmm. I already represent little by We shall weave our own destiny by keeping my Tariq. We can give uh we can get more elusive unit. Tarek is leveling up. Shatter that, never submit. To preserve beauty and protect all life. <laughs> Disgusting. We draw a lot of card by this kind of play. <laughs> These gems aren't just for show. <laughs> 